Hey guys, I am sorry that there was no video. Um, there's not been a video recently. I literally have not turned on my camera to film in like about a week. <laughs> um, literally because I've been very, very busy and overwhelmed with doing a bunch of other things. But we're back now and yeah, we are, we're back. And I'm very, very happy and excited because today is actually a very, very special day. It is my birthday. So I'm not gonna tell you what day this is today. Um, because yeah but um today is kind of it's it's a good day and I'm very very excited and happy about it um I'm going to uh the Hill Center Theater today um in Sandy Utah because I love theater and I just love the whole vibe so I got my nails done too I love my nails I love them so much um I found a fantastic nail tech I kind of swore off like the normal mainstream nail salons just because like I like you know either a silent appointment or um just a very chilled appointment just chatting with my nail person so and I loved my nail stylist or my nail tech so much and I'm probably gonna go back to her and I also have another nail tech as well that I really really like that I'm probably gonna go back to as well once my nails grow out a little bit because these are extensions right here like these are like full-on extensions my nails are not this long um so i'm just super happy today i wanted to make a vlog and just like kind of take you guys along with me if i can um, i might have to get like a little clips with my phone honestly because I, i'm not very comfortable taking my camera out into public spaces that are around my hometown hawaii i'm perfectly fine with for some reason taking my camera out to a lot of different places you know just like going to see the sunrise or sunset or whatever but here in utah i'm not and i don't know why but i'm not and i'm not going to fight that i'm just going to understand that it's just a feeling that i have and yeah so but i'm i'm so happy today today's gonna be a good day i'm gonna take you along with me and uh, we're gonna see what happens. I'm probably gonna film some TikToks and some things today as well. I have a few ideas on my phone of what to film, but I wanna get my face on first, you know, like I put on some makeup first. So yeah, we're gonna see what happens with that. And okay, I'm reading a really good book right now. I don't remember what it's called because my Kindle, I actually updated it for um, Amazon Prime Day. Like I got a cover for it, like a screen cover, and then I got a um clear case for it and i absolutely love it oh and then as you can see i also got a pop socket for it too i absolutely love it oh and the pop socket i learned that's from cherry wallace so you can get one maybe you can get one that's magnetized so that's really cool um so that is just like it's my favorite thing right now to like do um and i read this i actually woke up at about three o'clock in the morning and i was like I fancy read my book so I did <laughs> and it was it's a really interesting book which I'm kind of interested to see where it goes I'm also a little nervous to see where it goes I I don't like going into books blind all the time but usually I do this one I did read a little subnosis of like a little bit of it I'm like okay let's see what happens and I start reading and I'm like okay this is interesting um yeah we're gonna see what what happens or where it goes but Anyways, I am going to make a book TikTok about that, or a book talk about that, um, when I finish it, which hopefully will be eventually. I'm not the fastest reader, and I don't read all the time anymore. I want to change that, but it's, it's hard for me to pick up books sometimes, guys. But because this book is on my mind a lot, I'm like, okay, I need to actually read this and see what happens. So um, I'm probably going to do that today as well, read that book, and I don't know what's going to happen today. Um, besides the play that I'm going to, but I'm very, very excited. And I'll bring you guys along with me, either with this or with my phone. So, mwah. see you soon. Okay, we need to talk um, religion for a minute again. I'm sorry, but we do. I just read, so I follow a lot of like different kinds of accounts when it comes to religion. And one of the accounts that I follow, because honestly, they can think more critically than I can in most situations. Like for me, my critical thinking skills come in much later after I've processed things and like figure things out. My processing takes a really long time sometimes. So when it comes to general conference in the LES church, 
I don't list to every single talk and every single thing, which I probably should, so that I can figure out how I feel about those certain topics and situations that those people are talking about, right? That those church leaders are talking about. In my last vlog, I talked about having feelings of needing to stay in the church and be full in. I just wanted to say, I could easily switch that up and be like, you know what? No, nah, not my thing. I can easily do that because it's a life choice. God, um, the God that I believe in, really cares about our agency. Hey guys, so I have been to the hail. Um, it was so amazing. Oh my goodness. I always love it when I get to go there. Um, it was just the environment is just so insane, honestly. Like I consider the environment at the hail to be very, very insane because of the way they set their stage up, which I don't know how good of a video I got of the stage, but I got some videos of it, which I'll insert here. It was just a really cool setup. They always have the best setups at the hail, in my opinion. And I got a couple snacks, and I wanted to talk you through what I got because I didn't actually eat them. I got a Coke for first of all, Coca Cola. And then I got a, um, what are these? Turtles? I got a little turtle dude. Um, they're just like nuts mixed with chocolate and stuff like that on it. But I got a turtle and dark chocolate. And then I got a Megabyte chocolate chip cookie. Megabyte chocolate chip cookie. And then I got a Good Hope S'more gluten-free chocolate chip cookie, or actually a s'more cookie. And then I just got some granola from this company, which I don't even know. I've never had granola from this company before, so. But yeah, I thought it was cute, so I wanted to try it. They do a lot of gluten-free options right now, which I really, really appreciate. Um, but yeah, I've just been having the best day, honestly. It's been so good. I've loved every single moment of it. Um... And now, I think, like, I just really had our dinner, which was so good as well. Um, and I'm honestly, I'm just very content with life at the moment. I really, am I am not focused? I'm very content with life at the moment. Like, beyond content with life. And it's so good, it makes me feel so happy to just, like, I love it. Um, but yeah, I am probably going to... And the clip here, I don't even know, honestly. My brain just like shut off for a second and it's like rebooting. So I'm gonna go and I'll chat with you soon. Hey guys, how's it going? It is the next day now and I am gonna try to do some batch filming today. Today is a Sunday and I'm gonna try to do some batch filming today of like some TikToks and things like that. I don't know how I'm gonna do it because I don't really get how the draft things work. Like, I don't know how to, like, save things into drafts and then how to pick them up back later. You know, like, I don't know how to do that because TikTok isn't the most user-friendly, but I'm going to also look up Instagram Reel editing videos and see how to edit Instagram Reels so that I can, like, actually make Instagram Reels for you guys because I'd love to do that as well. I'm going to try to do some batch editing and we'll see how it goes. Um... Not batch editing, batch filming, and then I'll batch edit later on as I'm getting ready to release them. Um, <clears throat> I also I just do a lot of batch filming today and then release everything while I'm trying to figure out how to do like the batch filming and like I'm just I don't know what I'm gonna do today honestly. But I do know that it's gonna be a long day. I'm really tired, which is why I have one of these things. Um, it yesterday was so long, but it was so good. Oh my goodness. If you've never seen The Magician's Elephant, you need to see it. And by the way, in the theater, they didn't say elephant, they said elephant. So, so I'm like, okay, probably they're pronouncing it elephant. Cool, I don't care. So um, I don't care how it's pronounced, just as long as I can say the name. So The Magician's Elephant, and this is the first time it's ever been perform performed on a stage, I believe. That I believe that's what um, world premiere means by that. So it was really, really cool. It was really, really cute. I really liked it. Um, 
when I go to the hill, I'm always very, like, it's the Hill Center Theater in Sandy, Utah, by the way. When I go there, I'm always very intrigued, like, okay, there's lots of sensory things going on around. Um, and for somebody with sensory issues, I'm like, okay, I can handle this just for a few minutes, you know. But if they continued on with, like, the sensory things for more than a couple, more than, like, how long they did, I would have been very, like, I was, I probably would have been really, really overstimulated. I was really overstimulated to begin with, um, just, like, sitting in there, the entire play starts off with strobing lights, which they do, to their credit, they do have a sign out front saying, like, there's gonna be strobing lights, there's gonna be fake snow, there's gonna be, like, X, Y, Z, you know, it's gonna be X, Y, Z. But, um, they, they do give that out, but not everybody reads the sign, so if you don't have to know how to read the sign, sorry, I'm checking my eyebrows, if you don't have to know how to read the sign, you're gonna be out of luck. <laughs> And, uh, I just, I think that it's so freaking lovely. Like, the play was so lovely in itself. And basically, all I wanted for my birthday was, um, an experience, which I got that. And it was so good. Oh, my goodness. I loved it. I do wonder, like, what, like, because they do have, like, some sensory-friendly showings. But I'm sure they all fill up super fast, right? I wish that they did more of those. I wish that they did those, like, you know, like, on a specific day of the week. Or, like, <clears throat> just like at certain times like i wish that they would do more sensory friendly showings um because people like there's a lot of people with sensory sensitivities myself included who are just like okay this is intense i don't know if i like this part of the play right now because it's very intense and it's just like boom in your face um but i did love it anyway um but it's got me thinking like can they do more of the sensory sensitivity ones because that'd be fantastic <laughs> You know, but I don't know. Anyway, I'm just rambling at this point. But uh, I'm going to do some batch filming today. We'll see what comes of it and we'll see when it comes out. So, first, hey guys. Um, my tripod's going to be all over the place for a little bit. I'm sorry. I'm currently at my friend Jenna's house, which you've seen her in the vlogs before. Um, she's one of my very best friends in the entire world. And today we are at her house and we are making little fairy houses out of carvable pumpkins, which is carvable fake pumpkins, I should say, which is very, very fun. And I'm very, very happy about it. So we're going to do a little time lapse as soon as I can get this set up correctly. Um, I need the thing to move over. Is this good? Is this okay? I don't know what's going on. I can move, like, since I don't really need this kit. This is like all my painting and fun stuff. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, yeah. You're good. Okay. So mm -hmm. I'm over here. Hi. Can't Hello. really make a different angle out of this. Or maybe I could. Maybe I could go like this. Um, let's see if I can go like this with it. Oh, that's much better. This is much better. Is this okay right here? Yes. Sick. Okay. I'm trying to think if I want to paint leaves or not. <laughs> There we go. This is how my door looks. This is how the back door looks. And I just made two little windows that I painted in white. And that is what I made. And now I'm going to put it on my pumpkin right here. Well, I'm going to carve it and then I'm going to put it on my pumpkin. So, yeah, that's what's going on right now. <laughs>
camera, you guys. My camera automatically shuts off like after every 10 minutes. This is how mine looks like. And it has some fairy lights in it. It looks so good. Hey guys, I'm back home now and I do apologize. I've never gotten a battery changing um, sign on my camera, that's the word, on my camera ever. Like I've never gotten that, so that was the first for me. But I'm back home, my craft is over there. And I'm just chilling watching my, my Kelly Jancy video and I'm so happy right now. Um, it's gonna be a good evening, so. Um, I don't know if I want to leave the vlog here or not, but I definitely do want to say thank you guys so much for watching it so far. Um, it's been such a blast and I've loved filming this. It's going to be a long vlog um, to edit, but I'm really, really excited about it, so. Hey guys, how's it going? I don't know when this video is going to go out now because, quite honestly, it's been a heck of a week for me. Um, but I do know that it's hopefully going to come out. That was like more aggressive than I wanted it to be. I do know it's hopefully going to come out soon. Um, I'm hoping, honestly, to get it out tomorrow. I want to stay up late and edit tonight, but I don't know how well it's going to go. Um, because I have a lot that I have to edit. So I might go up tomorrow in the afternoon instead of 10 a.m. But yeah. Hey guys, how's it going? It is the next day. It is Friday. So I'm hopefully going to be editing this vlog and getting it up today. But I just wanted to say I am making the changes to my room. And I'm very, very excited about it, honestly. I think it's going to be refreshing to make these changes. And I'm really happy about it. It's going to take a while to get it done. But... And I'm not going to be doing it by myself. Um, I wish I was, but I'm not very good with power tools. And I want to, like, there's, like, a, um, there's hooks over there. That, hold on. There's hooks. Those hooks right there. Yeah, those ones right by my door. Um, I want to take them down because I'm trying to get rid of them. And I actually want to put up that map that I have, um, instead. And just, like, have it there. But I honestly don't really know... If I actually do want to put up that map, I kind of just want to take the hooks down. I just want my room to look a lot cleaner and just a lot more, you know, like, I just want it to look cleaner and more neutral. Um, <clears throat> so that's kind of like what I'm going for. Um, I don't really know what, how it's going to work out, but I know that I'm going to try really hard to. I want to say that I am going to be getting, um, the XBLR Club again because that is one of my most viewed videos ever on my channel, the XBLR Club truth about XBLR Club video. And I'm like, you know what? Let's do an update. And see how it goes. See how it is. Because it's been up and running and I personally don't have it. So I have to get it again and get going on it. So we're going to see what happens with that. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing. Also, please follow my Instagram, which is at Manda, which you can follow it. It'll be down in the description down below because I don't know how to put links on the screen. It's just not something I know how to do. And... Yeah, um, I post a lot of different things on there, not all the time, but I post like polls on there every once in a while, I'll post like different things on there every once in a while. It's hard for me to know what to post on my public Instagram account, like, because like I don't know really what y'all want to see. So, let me know what you guys would like to see. Um, let me know what you guys would like to see on my Instagram, because I would love to post more on there. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much, Mwah, love it, and I'll see you next time.